How you doing guys? Hey. Uh, today is Friday, December 7th and we got we, some pickups. Yep, we got three unboxings uh, right there. One of them I already opened up that came on Sunday and we're going to start off with that one. Um, From uh... Cinema Man. Um, there was a couple of things pre-Black Friday sale that Best Buy had and we two, didn't have them in like yeah. 250 radius nothing so so I asked him if he can grab them for me and I'll pay pal on the money so he did he shipped them I got them I'm happy thank you and uh the first one that I got is how to train your dragon in 3d this is uh the blu-ray 3d dvd it just doesn't have the regular 2D, similar to the Mega Mine that DreamWorks released, but I already have a, a two pack of both of the uh, both of the movies, so I just really wanted it for the 3D. Yeah, you did. So I'm super excited to have that, beefing up more of the 3D collection. Uh, the next one is How to Train Your Dragon 2. This one is the mm -hmm. 3D. 3D. <laughs> this is the 3D, Blu-ray, Blu-ray, DVD, with uh, digital HD. So I'm super excited to have both of these. Thank you, Chris, for uh, sending that. I really appreciate it. And two more 3D Sad collection. Um, next one I got was from Disney Movie Club. I actually screwed up and ordered this movie through uh, Disney Movie Club and I actually picked it up on Black Friday from Best Buy. Uh, for $14.99 if I remember or I think it was $12.99 I don't remember and exactly and have another movie twice yeah so this is something that That's I'll okay. probably return and that is uh, Ant-Man vs. the Wasp on 4K with the uh, lenticular slip like I, I said, see why you had to make sure you got it. Oh. Yeah, I wanted to buy this movie on 4K. And like I said, I ordered through the Disney Movie Club just so uh, I can get a, uh, one more closer to getting my VIP status so I can get everything 50% off. So I'll actually, if I return it, I'll just return it through Walmart because Walmart's the only place I didn't have this on sale. <laughs> and it's the same price as Disney Movie Club. So I'll get to still keep my fulfillment and... I'll just trade it in for some retro slips if I uh, when the new ones in February come out. But for right now, like I said, I'm not a second copy of this. So. Return it to the place that's not having a sale on it. Exactly. Uh, the last package is from Absolute Sublime. Uh, he did a for sale video a little while ago. And um, there was a couple of things that he had. I wanted to order and uh, it took a little bit longer to get here than usual so uh, because of that he threw a couple of extra things in there for me for my collection so we're gonna open this up and check it out together and see what I got because like I said I don't actually remember what I bought and see what the, the extra ones are so already pre cracked this one open so I can have it ready for you guys so the first one that we're gonna do is gonna be this one looks like this is one of the freebies and that's uh, from Paris with love with uh, John Travolta I have this movie but on DVD, not on Blu-ray. This is in one of those uh, blockbuster cases. I was going to say, you got it in the retro blockbuster case. Yeah, <laughs> but uh, I'll throw it in a Blu-ray uh, case and throw it in my collection. So I'll be, pull, I'll be upgrading this one in my collection. So I'm happy to have that. Uh, the next one. Previewed. I saw the case. And just the creepy case alone, I was like, ah, I'm going to pick it up. And that's Dark. This is from uh, the executive producer, Joe Dante, that 
the twist of mind that brought you Gremlins and the Howling. So I said I wanted to check that one out just on that case alone. It looked pretty cool, but I wanted to have that in the collection. Next one, this is one of the freebies also. It's the White River Kid with Antonio Banderas and Ellen Barkin. Never heard of this movie, but it looks super 80s cheese. And if anybody knows me, I love my 80s cheese. So I'm kind of happy to have this one in the collection. I'll be checking that one out. Uh, the next one Ooh, is a case. another freebie. And it's uh, the big tease. And as Marie says, in a snapper. It just comes out. I'm like, shoot. I and uh, I don't have this movie in my collection. I actually never heard of it. Um, yeah, this looks like another 80s movie. But like I said, it looks super cheese-tastic. And... I love those type of movies. So, it'll be another one go. good for the collection. This one, I'm not 100% remember if I have it in my collection, but I'll have to find out. And it's uh, Eight Heads in a Duffel Bag with Joe Pesci. I saw this movie a long time ago. I actually think I've seen this in theaters when I was a kid. But it's been so long, I don't remember. But it, And it's been so long since I've actually watched it. But I remember really liking this movie. So if I don't have it in my collection, it is in my collection now. Um, next, we're going to go on to some Blu-rays that I see in here. Uh, the first one is... Ah, there you go. Lost Boys, The Thirst, if... Uh, if I remember right, this is the second one. I've seen it. It's good. In uh, the franchise. So that's pretty cool. I think I only have the DVD of this. So now I have the Blu-ray. So that's Upgrade. pretty awesome. Don't forget to pull the Blu-ray out of your collection. Yeah. <laughs> this one I'm super excited to have. I remember when they first announced that this was coming out. I really wanted this movie. That's a hot slip. Yeah. And uh, it's an MVD release. And that's... H.P. Lovecraft's The Unnameable. Like I said, it looks super up my alley. I, I don't remember if I saw this when I was a kid, but it has a, a ton of special features, uh, newly restored 4K restoration, bunch of commentaries, uh, interviews, trailers, photo gal gallery, like I said great great release of this so when he was getting rid of it i was definitely scooping this one up it looks cool oh yeah uh the next one if anybody knows me i love arrow video to me it's my favorite company out there and he had this one for sale and i wanted to scoop it up and that was scalpel I never really found this for cheap, and I've been wanting this in my collection. This actually has two different versions. That it has the green hue style version that was originally released, and then one that they actually cleaned up the color, so you can watch it the way the director intended you to watch it, or the way Arrow restored it. But bunch of special features, uh, 2K restoration scan of this one. Um, a bunch of commentaries and interviews and again like i said arrow is my favorite company i like their cases they're yeah. not like cheese uh cheap uh eco cases yeah not that there's anything wrong with them they, they always have like something to protect good booklets a lot of times uh reversible artwork or posters. so yeah this one has a nice um booklet inside about the whole movie and everything. It has a reversible artwork. Like I said, Arrow, when it comes to companies, they're always top of the food chain for me. Top notch. Oh, yeah. No hot trash there? Nope. <laughs> Next one is uh, an Arrow Academy release. This is uh, 
Smash Palace. Never seen it. No, don't really even know anything about it, but it was Arrow Academy. It was a good deal. I was picking it up. You didn't have it. Nope, I didn't have it. So this one again doesn't have a ton of special features, but a good amount for a release. And it's something I'll be checking out very soon. But that's Smash Palace. Next one is a movie I actually bought on Black Friday. I forgot, like I said, <laughs> that uh, I ordered this from him. And on Black Friday, I just went nuts and just kept on throwing stuff in my basket. So I actually have a second copy of this now. And that's Super Troopers 2. I haven't watched it yet, but I do own it. If uh, anybody's interested in a copy of Super Troopers 2 and they don't have it, uh, send me a DM on Instagram or leave a comment down below. We can make a deal and I'll ship it to you ASAP. All right. Uh, next one. It's a four movie comedy collection with uh, Walk Hard, The Dewey Cox Story. <laughs> Uh, the brothers Solomon fired up and balls out. That's a nice title. Yeah, walk hard, walk hard. It's the only one I've actually seen in this collection. It, this is a Mill Creek release, and yep, it has uh, two movies on each disc. But it's a nice release. It has, like I said, four movies in a collection. So. I don't know if any of... I know uh, Walk Hard, The Dewey Cox Story was released as a single release on Blu-ray, but I'm not sure if the other ones were, so... No idea. That's uh, a cool release to have if you're into comedies. But another one for the collection. Uh, this one I don't really know anything about, but Joaquin Phoenix this year has been killing it with... Uh, uh, oh, man. Now I'm drawing a blank. We were never really here. Oh. Um, he's going to be Is doing it. No, he's uh, going to be doing the Joker in 2020. He did her. He's just been really stepping up his game. So this is a movie he had for sale, and I wanted to check it out just because I have Wonky Phoenix in it. But it's uh, don't worry, he won't get far on foot. This has Joaquin Phoenix, uh, Mara, uh, Rooney Mara, Jack Black, and Jonah Hill, but. Looks like a cool movie, so it'll be something to check out. With a nice matte slippy? Yep. It's fantastic. Oh, yeah, it's spectacular. <laughs> but uh, next one, it's Batman and Mr. Freeze. I've been picking up a lot of these DC animated movies. It's a new one for the collection I didn't have, so it was a good price. I scooped it, but... That's that one. Getting a little tall, so I'm holding it. Yeah. Just in case. You this one is another freebie. And oh. uh, I have the DVD of it, but I don't have the Blu ray, and I love these movies. Get rid of those DVDs. Uh, the Punisher <laughs> War Zone. Like I said, I, if I remember right, I think this one. This is the one that I think I like the most. I don't really remember. But I really enjoy the Punisher movies. And I, I know that they recently got released all on 4K. But I really wanted to scoop that one up. So I'm kind of glad that he gave me that one as a freebie. Nice. Next one. I saw that he had this for sale. And I really was intrigued about watching this one. And that's The Book Club. And that has uh, Diane Keaton, Jane Fonda, uh, Candace Byrne, and Mary Steenburgen. Look at that so, tagline on the back. Yeah. It's <laughs> Fifty Shades Great. So, how can you say no to that? And it's a people's pick. Again, stupid stickers. But I wanted to check that one out. I like those style movies. I like Diane Keaton. Next one is... Uh, First Reformed with Ethan Hawke. It looks like a, a really good thriller. Has Amanda Seyfried also in it. So 
I really wanted to check that one out. It looked like a, a nice fun watch. The artwork is intriguing. Yeah. So, and it has a slip. So, that's a cool one. <laughs> this one, when uh, I first saw, when I first heard about it, it was I pretty much heard about it when it first came, when it first uh, got released to physical. I heard that it was similar to John Wick, but with uh, a diamond, like a diamond uh, heist or something like that. And that's Siberia with Keanu Reeves. I love both of the John Wicks. They are yeah. awesome. So, Keanu with the John Wick movie has been killing it. And Siberia looked like a similar style movie. So, probably not as good as John Wick. Can't wait for John Wick Chapter 3 next year in the summer. I'm excited, yeah. But I really wanted to pick this one up to check it out. Looks like the day after tomorrow in the background at a glance. Oh, yeah. Oh. And then this, this next movie. Oh, yeah. Is uh, as Rick would say, hot trash. But uh, in four K, Joe. Yeah, I look with at the slip. Yep, yeah, I look at it as if you're gonna own hot trash, <laughs> own hot trash on four K, oh, and that's the spy who dumped me. I heard this movie is like Rick says, hot trash. <laughs> but I wanted to check it out, and if you're gonna check out hot trash. You need to stay classy and have it high def. Yeah. Oh, geez. You got to get it in 4K. So, uh, yeah. What else can you say about that movie? Okay. Uh, the last one in this box is. It's a little bit better than that one. Yeah. Yeah. It's a steel book. And me and her are really not into anime. Japanese anime. And I think I only have one Japanese anime in my collection, but. I saw this steel book and just the colors alone, I had to buy it, even if I never ever watch it's it. Goodbye. But, I'll give it to you. And that's Metropolis. Like I said it's a Mill Creek uh, steel book. I just noticed the slip. Yeah, the front cover looks kind of like the Terminator with uh, her face kind of ripped and it looked uh, biomechanical underneath. But there's the back of it right there. But the slip actually has, and what I love about Mill Creek steel books is you don't have to turkey bag them because they come with a nice clear slip that has the name right there, then has all the features on the slip. And it doesn't clutter the artwork on the front of the slip. It's really, you know, indented over here and it says Metropolis, so you can't really see, but there's the front. And there's the back artwork, but nicely done. Oh yeah, Mill Creek. Their steel books are are really nice, and I hope uh, they do more of them. There's the interior artwork for it with uh, the discs, but that looks for anime. I can see why you bought that. Yeah. Yeah. I'll it give was, it to you. It was it was a good deal, and I really wanted to pick this one up. So that's Metropolis. And that's pretty much everything that we got. Let me double finger this so I don't drop all the slips and damage you them. You got the, the good ones over there. Yeah, I left you with all the DVDs. Again. But that's <laughs> everything for this week. Comment below if you see any hot trash besides uh, the spot you jumped away. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> if you've seen any of these movies, Leave a comment down below if you like to. Let me know out of this uh, unboxing, which is your favorite movie that we picked up. And if you need Super Troopers 2 or Ant-Man vs. Wasp. Yeah, give me a, a shout out down in the comments or DM me on Instagram. And we'll make a deal on either one of them if you like. And... Uh, that's it for this video. Please hit the like button down below. If you want to see more videos from us, hit the subscribe button, hit the bell notification, and we'll uh, have more for you. Until the next one, have a good one. Bye. Bye.